beware of too narrow a focus, Durga. If Mahabalasura triumphs here, then what difference will it make in the long view? You must accept that some things are beyond the ability of mortals to affect.
guards. I can't get down there. Golu! Golu! I'm coming! until the great sundering. Gift, Lord Vishnu? It seems so.
is a marvel. It is surely a weapon of the gods. Thank you. Who is the watch over me? For sending me such good fortune. I am surprised, Lord Vishnu. Your bow is a mighty gift. The scales must be balanced, must they not? The girl earned her prize.
What do I do now? Another mandala, another vision of her past.
had captured the children? What was their purpose? Had Raji known the truth, she may simply have given up. For this being was utterly ruthless, and the very heavens were at risk. It is strange, is it not, that such a child should be born of such a bloodline at exactly the time that is needed. Who can say how such things come about? Not I. Ah, see, they have depicted Shakti's first address to us. I still hear her words echo, even now. I am Adi Parashakti. I am the absolute reality. She told us that she, the eternal font of energy, beyond form and limit, had created us to govern the universe as aspects of her power. To Brahma, she gave the role of creator and set the wise Saraswati, the primeval sound, as his concert. Together, they would create the universe. She assigned the role of preserver, of protector, in all my needful incarnations, with Lakshmi as my consort, so that prosperity and wealth would be at my fingertips. Rudra would become the lord of time, both destroyer and regenerator of the universe and would grow to surpass all Shakti's other forms. One half would become Lord Shiva, destroyer of evil. The other, but you know this, Durga, for the other half was you. Yeah. 
Her love strengthens her purpose.
whatever they want from you, whatever stands in my way, I am coming for you, little brother. They will not stop me. I won't let them hurt you, I swear. over us. She has always been one of yours. And she's correct. You think too much of this one. She is important. She holds hope for the mortals of the world. Of course I will watch over her. It is strange, is it not? that a place of such beauty and intricate design should have been created as a bastion of war? War is the means they are given to change the world. They only give it the respect that it is due. War is not the only way. was Golu. Why did the demons want him? Just summoned a dark mandala, a portal to another place. Raji rushed to stop them, but the demon chieftain blocked her path. 
and suddenly Golu was gone. The demon defeated, the children rushed to thank Raji. But the stone had been weakened by the dark mandala. Perhaps Raji was about to die. Perhaps she had failed. They took Raji's body and they carried it away. As Raji drifted, a vision came to her. Who was that with her brother? What did they want? She awoke on the boat, and in the far distance, she could see a city. Great kings of the past had fashioned it, and had given their lives for it. But 
but now the inhabitants were enthralled to a vast, lurking shadow, stripped of their own will. The guardians blessed Raji, for she was the only hope for these people. Do I ask too much of her? Time again will tell. 